Hi, how's it going everybody? Welcome to my channel. Today I'll be reviewing these Mobileite Plus UHS-2 SD card readers from Kingston Technologies. As the name suggests, these are fast SD card readers. They're designed to take advantage of the speeds UHS-2 cards offer. These are also backwards compatible with UHS-1 cards and I actually purchased these to use with UHS-1 cards. I don't own any UHS-2 cards. In case you're wondering why I would do this, I'll explain in just a moment. First, let's take a look at the devices themselves. So Kingston makes two variants of these. I actually have both of them here. One is designed for use with SD cards and the other one is designed for use with the smaller form factor micro SD cards. They both look very similar and share the same Mobileye aim. So be careful when you purchase these because you could pick up uh, the wrong one. I actually purchased the micro SD card reader thinking it was the SD card version. So yeah, don't make the same mistake I made. I ended up keeping both because I also have micro SD cards, but you may be in a different situation. If you're only going to pick up one, I would recommend to pick up the SD card reader because you could always get an adapter for micro SD cards. But anyway, I picked both of these up for Amazon for around $22 for the micro SD card version and $18 for the SD card variant. Uh, both of those are in Canadian dollars, so they're probably a few dollars cheaper in the US. Uh, they came in the packaging you see right here. I did a much better job opening up one package than the other. Didn't have scissors with me for one of them, but not much to look at anyways. On the back of the package, it says that these are compatible with Windows, Mac, Linux, and Chrome OS. So good compatibility. The devices themselves are made of plastic and it's a pretty hard feeling, durable uh, feeling plastic. However, I think if you step on these, they could potentially break. They're also very small. So even though this makes them great for storage and just carrying around, it also makes them pretty easy to misplace. I actually have mine attached to like a longer USB-C dongle. I don't know, it just makes it easier for me to locate them when I throw them in the side pocket on my laptop bag. I only saw them in this one color on Amazon, which is the black. Uh, I'm not sure if they come in any other colors. Both of the devices have the Kingston logo on one side and on the back there's just some like manufacturing information. Both of them are pretty plain as you can see. They have the Kingston logo on one side. On the back they have a slot for the SD card or the micro SD card. And on the other side they have the USB type A connector. Now on the back of the packaging it says that these are capable of USB 3.2 Gen 1 speeds which is up to 5 gigabits per second. That's gigabytes not gigabits. And like I said, I don't have any UHS-2 cards that could take full advantage of those speeds, but I do have some fast UHS-1 cards that could reach speeds my old SD card reader was not capable of reaching. So if you have any old SD cards like UHS-1 cards that have advertised read speeds beyond what your SD card reader uh, seems to be able to produce, then it might be your card reader and not the SD card. And I'm going to demonstrate that now. This is a Ugreen like multi card reader, which I've had for three years now. Nothing wrong with the device. In fact, it's actually worked great for the three years that I've owned it. it has a bunch of different ports, one for SD card, micro SD, CF. And like I said, it's been very solid. It also connects to your computer through USB 3.0. However, the SD card reader itself on this doesn't seem to be high speeds. For example, one of my SD cards is capable of read speeds of up to 160 megabytes per second. If I put that card in my Ugreen reader, as you can see, I can only reach speeds of about 97 megabytes per second when I try to transfer files from an SD card to my computer. Now if I put that same SD card into one of the Kingston Mobileite readers, I get transfer speeds of up to 147 megabytes per second, which is very close to the advertised speeds. So as you can see, the Kingston card reader is capable of much higher speeds. Uh, so far I've tested both SanDisk and Lexer cards on these, so compatibility seems to be good so far. 
Overall, I'm very happy with these card readers. As someone who is often transferring data from an SD card to a computer, the faster speeds are a real time saver. Uh, even if you're like me and only have UHS-1 cards, these readers can help you take full advantage of the card speeds. These also provide some future proofing if you decide to upgrade to UHS-2 cards later. And lastly, the price is very good too. Uh, I remember looking at some other UHS-2 cards and they were relatively pretty expensive. And that's it for me today, guys. Hopefully that video helped you out. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to this channel for more review videos. Give this video a like if this helped you out. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Peace.